The first stunning result of the 2023 FIBA World Cup was recorded on Sunday when France was eliminated after its second loss in the group stage. France, the 2020 Olympic silver medalist, fell by two points to Latvia after a disappointing fourth quarter in which it scored just 12 points. Latvia outscored France by 14 points in the final frame to knock Roddy Gobert and co. out of the championship consideration. France's unexpected early elimination capped a day of incredible performances across Indonesia, Japan and Philippines. Dennis Kroeder turned in the best individual showing for Germany while Japan picked up an historic win in front of its own fans. France entered as one of the favourites to win the World Cup but instead it will go home without winning any honours. Alexandre Usyk ended Daniel Dabo's World Heavyweight title dream with a ninth round knockout in Rocklaw. Usyk kept hold of WBA, IBF and WBO belts with a 14 knockout win in 21 fights, much to the delight of the large contingent of his fellow Ukrainians who have resided in Poland since Russia's invasion of their country last year. Usyk upped the pace in the seventh, forcing Dabus to take a backward step and leaving the Londoner mark for the first time. Dabus recovered in the eighth, but in the final 10 seconds, he was dropped to the canvas. The US Open begins on Monday with a nation hoping that Coco Golf might win her first Grand Slam title and light up women's tennis in the United States. But when it comes to the men's event, for all the potential storylines, will Carlos Alcaraz and Novak Djokovic get through their respective side of the draw to set up another mouth-watering contest? The two men have dominated the big events this year, with Djokovic winning the Australian Open and the French Open, while Alcaraz clinched his first Wimbledon title. That's Spot News. I am Kabir Lowell.